So then here we are on the River Ebro over in Spain and it's my first ever trip to, to this famous river. I've never fished for the carp in Spain so this is a first for me and I'm really excited about it and really looking forward to it. We've got four days on the river and we're here with Gary Sheridan of Dream Carp Fishing. Now Gary's been living out here for 18 years and he assures me that we've got a really, really good chance of catching a 30 pound common, which is what I've come over here for. We've escaped the, the cold of England and the busy day ticket lakes and there's absolutely nobody here. So we've got a great choice of swim and hopefully we're gonna see some big fish for the cameras. This river has been producing a good head of 50 and 60 pound fish. When you come here on a trip, you're gonna be uh, guaranteed near enough to get a 30 pounder and possibly a 40 pound fish and even a 50 pound common carp. They've all been stocked into the river back in the 1950s and now they're piling weight on. Every year these fish are getting much bigger. They've got a, a good head of catfish in here, well over 200 pound, and a couple of years ago producing a world record fish and uh, we're hoping to get some, some good fish. We're hoping definitely that we can land some 40s to show you on the video. And uh, from there, we're gonna definitely land some 30s. That's, that, I'm pretty confident of that. How big is it, Beth? It's a piece of weed. <laughs> it was what? It's a lump of weed, I thought. <laughs> a lump of weed that eventually turned into a big carp. What time is it now? It's about one o'clock in the afternoon on a halibut pellet with a bit of plastic corn. And it's a PB from the, from the Ebro for you, isn't it? Yep. Fishing on the Ebro here for 18 years now, and um, we've had great success in catching a lot of uh, big fish, common carp up to 54 pound plus, with a good head of fish over 50 pound. And the main attractant for them fish has been a, a bait which I've developed called Klingon bait. And this bait simply, it's a pellet which has a second skin, and the process that we go through to make that bait is a liquid which we've developed here which is five different flavours all in one and we leave the bait soaking in there for about 15 to 20 minutes and as you can see it's well gloved and it coats the hook and everything unlike an ordinary glug then we we take the bait and we simply leave the bait in a powder which has protein meat sauce and ground down pellets and some other fine ingredients in there and once the pellets coated we simply take it out and you can see it finally coats everything and we'll leave that for about two hours now in a tub where it'll dry off and when we cast it in simply add a small PVA bag and we'll slide that down the hook link and it'll sit pretty on top there we've been casting them out for about 50 meters and over the last 24 48 hours we've been getting fish to 42 pound on these bait they've really proved the worth like little bars of gold they are. And uh, we're gonna continue with that now for the rest of the day. And hopefully Simon is gonna pull a, a 40 pounder out and uh, it'll put a smile on everybody's face.
So Simon, you got to... Uh... Yeah, got myself a nice one in the end, a 39 pound common, so very chuffed with that. Had a couple of fish up to 29, uh, well, 220, no, is it 320, I've had three different 29s, and then uh, this one's turned up this, this morning on a single pellet, over a little PVA stick with uh, two or three pellets on the side, so nice fight. Down here in my back garden, Simon, with the cow yeb, and uh, we're just cooking some lamb chops. What a fantastic week on the Abro, and uh, we fished to 42 pounds. This is a lovely way to end it, cooking out in the open. Brilliant. Can't beat it.